The questions and concerns are coming from all directions in the quest to get schools back open. The burden facing local administrators to figure out how to safely get kids back in the classroom is massive. And it doesn't help when the guidelines are not consistent and the coronavirus is. We need to get our kids back in school. And there is no tougher challenge for administrators across Hampton Roads. As chair of the Newport News School Board, Gary Hunter's phone is ringing off the hook. One question after another. Uh, will it start on time? And the uh, answer to me is right now we're moving forward as if school is going to open up in September. It, it is fair to say that uh, planning for school reopening has been very challenging. Because for superintendents like Virginia Beach's Aaron Spence, they are operating on a landscape of uncertainty, a virus with a mind of its own, and mixed messages from the government and health professionals. We do get changing guidance, and we do get guidance that's sometimes at odds uh, with other guidance. For instance, the CDC says students should remain six feet apart, while the American Academy of Pediatrics is suggesting three feet might be sufficient. And sometimes what's said to be safe for kids isn't safe for adults. Then politics gets in the way. This shouldn't be a political issue. This is about educating children. And we should all be working together. Well, Newport News is supposed to announce its plan July 20th, and Gary Hunter, he expects it will be a hybrid model, some virtual learning and some in-person instruction as well.